In this video, we will review the floor section of the Yelp Seat Me Restaurant Manager app for the iPad. From the floor, you'll see your table layout and a list of reservations for the current day. The Reservations tab on the right displays your list of reservations. The list shows that John has a reservation for 8.30. The green dot in the reservation cell indicates that this reservation was made online. Let's begin by assigning server sections. Click on the Servers tab. Next, click here to add a list of names of your servers. Next, click the Assign Tables button and then select your servers from the list. You can finger paint over the tables that are assigned to each server. When you are finished assigning tables, click Done. Let's create a new reservation for today. Click here. Add your guest name. If the reservation is for a returning guest, and their name is already stored in your guest book, you will see their name in the list of existing guests below. Click here to create the guest record in your guest book. You can add the guest phone number and email. Enter any additional details about the guest. This includes tags, notes, and special dates. Next, enter how many guests are in the party. Click here to find an available table. This icon, the green circle with a check mark, indicates that a table is available and the right capacity for the party. Tables with numbers indicate that the table is available but either too small or too large for this party size. The numbers represent the minimum and maximum party size that should be sat at the table. Table 13 shows a conflict flag. You cannot sit this party here because this table is reserved for John. There is also a section for reservation notes. When you are finished entering the details of the reservation, click Create. A blue flag in the reservation cell indicates that this reservation includes additional information about the reservation or the guest. When a party arrives, you can press and hold their name in the list and then drag and drop the reservation to the assigned table. At the bottom of the list, there is a quick seat tool for walk-in parties. A party can be sat at multiple tables using a shortcut. Click and drag an available empty table on top of a seated reservation to show that the party spans across multiple tables. If a party arrives and a table is not available, you can add their name to the wait list. Quota wait time. There is a section for notes. When a table is available, click on the guest name to send an SMS. When a table is finished with their meal, double tap the table and select Finished. Let's return to the Servers tab. The list displays the current and total cover counts for the shift. At the end of a shift, you can cut the server's table assignments. You can click on the timers icon for additional information about the evening's reservations. You can also add shift notes. There is also a help section to review the icons and functions of the SeatMe system.
If you have additional questions, please contact your account manager.